Darters are a uh, group of fish that are uh, usually small, bottom-dwelling stream fish. There's roughly 110 species of described darters in Tennessee, and uh, over 200 in the U.S. And with very rare exception, they're only found in the United States. We've had a, a darter exhibit in the past, pretty much since we've opened, but it was a relatively large exhibit compared to the size of the animal. While it was perfectly serviceable, the darters, which are usually on average three inches, tended to get lost sort of in this larger exhibit. They're, they inhabit the bottom, so they just stayed on the bottom doing what darters do. From a distance, what you had was a, basically what looked like an empty exhibit. And so what we wanted to do was sort of shrink that down to sort of help focus your attention on the smaller fish. And since we were doing smaller tanks, we wanted to sort of take that opportunity to, instead of focusing on darters as a whole, as a group of fish, well, let's take advantage of this and have exhibits that are represent different river drainages. Tennessee has a, a wealth of different river drainages. That's why we have uh, so many different species of fish. Of the roughly 315 species we have, a third of them are darters. What we, what we wanted to do was use these smaller tanks to focus on a specific river drainage and in that way maybe help people sort of put together that you know not only are there all these different river drainages in Tennessee but they each house different species of darters that are only found in that specific drainage. One of the greatest things about zoos and aquariums is that you get to see um, some of your favorite animals but then you also get to come across something you maybe didn't know was out there in the first place and that's kind of neat too. And so darters, I think, are definitely in that latter group. They're not something that's very well known to people, but they're one, you know, one in three species of fish in Tennessee is a darter. And so it's important for us to get that out there and let people know that you've got this amazing diversity of these beautiful, sometimes stunning fish right in your backyard. Hopefully it's just something that they didn't know existed and, and now they do.